In the previous video, we built the base for the self-watering plant. Now we're going to build the insert for it. So I'm going to use this existing uh, part, and I'm going to lay a sketch down on the top portion of this inlet here. I'm just going to select here, and I'm going to lay that sketch down uh, directly on that, or that plane down directly on that, so we can see that here. I'm going to orientate from the top view. I'm going to put a sketch on that plane one. I'm going to grab my center point circle tool and I'm going to draw a 4.68 inch circle. I'm going to extrude that uh, six and a half inches. I want to make sure that extrusion goes towards the part. So I'm going to flip that direction there, and then I'm going to green check mark that. Uh, I do not want to make that as part of an addition. I want to make that as new. So I can look at this now from the top view. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a sketch. I'm going to lay it down on the top of this part. I'm going to grab my center point circle and I'm going to find the center point right there and I'm going to draw a one inch or 1.1 inch circle or zero one. There we go. Uh, and that is a little off, so I'm obviously did not get that in the right spot. So I'm going to undo that circle, and let's try that again. So I'm going to look for here. We're going to go to the center point here. Let's get a little zooming in action going on. There we go. There we go. I'm going to draw that 1.01 .01 inches. Perfect. So what I'm going to do with this sketch is use this to uh, make my cutout on the uh, part. So you can see I'm going to hide that sketch here. And the reason I made it a little bit larger is for 3D printing, so I don't get quite of a so tight of a fit in that. So the next thing I'm going to do is extrude that as a removal. So I'm going to click Extrude. I'm going to do a removal. And I'm going to click on uh, Through All. So if we take a look, I have that portion here for that uh, drain or that water inlet to go. So I'm going to look at this from the uh, front view now. I'm going to place a sketch on the front plane. And I'm going to start drawing that uh, line for uh, to make that uh, shape. So I'm going to go, starting at the bottom, I decided mine was going to be two inches here. I'm going to dimension that so that uh, it's 0.75 inches away. And then I'm going to grab another line. Now this one I'm going to extend outside of the actual uh, drawing itself because I'm going to do this as a, a, a cut or removal as a revolve. So as long as I'm outside, I'm just looking at using this drawing here for my removal. So I'm going to do a revolve here. I'm going to choose my center axis here. Well, it's not going to let me do that. So I'm, what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to go back into this sketch. I'm going to use a line and then a center line tool here. And now what I'll do is I'll do a revolve. Uh, around that center line and I'm going to do it as a removal. So we can see there is I have that general shape now of what I'm looking for.